Alright, where to now? France. West. Versailles. Versailles! Okay. From the arms factory in Germany all the way to Versailles. Ah, oh, the thorny forest that surrounds Versailles. Oh, I'm confused. Giant rose trees? Yeah, the, the uh, pollen inflicts confuse. Or it reverses your controls. Does it reverse, uh, jump things as well? I don't know. Can't jump well enough to find out. Uh, can you hit it with the holy water? Or just avoid it, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Apparently, it's just, um... You just gotta dodge. What oh god, what? There are thorn traps? And now there's water. Fountain. Oh, but it's a blood fountain! Uh, it the way that that glowy orb went, it looked like the skeleton spit it out. Ah! That's another contra enemy right there. Yeah, it is. I don't wow. understand how to fight these. Jesus. I think you need to be like standing back and like stand out of its range and just stab forward repeatedly. Just like the way that it swings, stand like just outside its range, and okay, it just weirds. It just weirds. Like this one does the. Yeah, like if you just stand there and time your stab. Yeah. I have no more lives. I spent them all on not you again. Well, if they could kill enemies. Hey, axe armors. Yeah, actual axe armor. He's, he's running away. He's afraid of you. He should be. I have a spear. Spear beats axe. Right, right, is that how it works? Yep. Okay. Because the spear lets you keep the axe at... Well... Okay, it depends on the system that you're using. Yeah, I was gonna say, is, it, is that... Is that Fire Emblem? The spear... In... Axe beats sword, right? Yeah, in Fire Emblem, axe beats sword... No. No, it's the other way round. In Fire Emblem, spear... Beats sword, sword beats axe, axe beats spear. Well, in this case, sword just beats spear. But, spear but beat like axe. in, in um, uh, I don't know, I don't know. We haven't been John in a while. Yeah, let's be John. Everyone be John. Everyone is John. Don't 
don't really know why I'm in Versailles. I mean, you don't really know why you've been to any of these places, other than for the purposes of destroying ancient cultural artifacts. Mm. And also a munitions factory. Okay, look, look, we have, we have aliens. We've got more just aliens. At least the checkpoint it. But you, you cannot look at this and tell me that these are not Contra aliens. No, they're French. Well, you can ignore them at least. You go into the wine cellar, you need to swing. Yeah, I need to swing, don't I? And it looks like this is a place where yeah, this Eric would jump split through. characters. Oh, you can go backwards. Yep. It's, it's a bag man with bombs. Those are exploding loud. Not very big, though. It doesn't seem to be that big of a deal compared to the other enemies you've been dealing with. It's just kind of... Okay. Well, I don't like the looks of this. Welcome to spin round the tower. And you can't go into the background, because... reasons. They, they didn't have enough clock tower, so here's more. We got the wing guard. Just ascending this yeah. hole. Everyone knows the eternally rotating pole of Versailles, right? Oh, what the fuck is this? <laughs> I'm leaving. <laughs> I'm just. This is so stupid. I love it. I hate it, but I love it. It's a hammer shaker. Hammer looks like a pepper shaker. Kinda does. <laughs> ah! Iron Man! Hey, man. Ah, rapid press! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> they split the Tin Man into two different models! <laughs> uh -oh. Ah! It's that face thing! Where the center of it is the chalice, but the sides are two faces. Okay, but where's the actual boss? The actual boss is the pillar. Destroy 
Destroy the illusion! Yeah, the, the faces can't exist without the space between them. Do it. Hey! Aha! Now your face is one face! That was just the mid boss. Fortunately, that wasn't a structural pillar. Yeah. Okay, now you go straight to the real boss boss. Is this the Apotamus Elizabeth Barthray? Whatever her name was? Probably. If this is like the second to last stage. Yeah. Mothra! Yeah, she's an alien. She's one of those insectoid contra aliens. has been defeated. Yay. That means the game's over, right? So we beat the final boss. Right? The castle prosper in a pros Proserpi Proserpina. Okay. Final stage start. It's got birds, so it must be near the end. It's also got a big old blood moon. And reduces that shoot. Uh oh. Now that didn't look good. And yeah, the, the sound that they made when they shot is literally sh Oh god, look at this. I don't want to, but I have to. Uh, so I was going to say the sound that the Medusas make when they shoot is literally straight out of Contra Hardcore. And there was apparently a one up there that was hovering over the pit. This is weird. Let's just bisect reality. Trisect? Let's just separate reality a little. There's bloody tears falling.
somehow you didn't... platforming. I mean, it would be if it was upside right. And they bring me back here. Oh, really? And then this happens. Yeah. It does happen. right side up now. What kills me this time? How is reality gonna break today? Come up to a sub boss? Ah! Kinda? What in the... That's... the, the first boss, but... like... Not full health. Well, you checkpointed! Mm -hmm. oh, another one comes. Yeah going to be a series of them coming from, like, charging at you. I think you can kind of hear where they're coming from with the stereo sound. Kind of. Let's give you a mirror at the end of the segment. Ah, uh, it's a staircase. Always on its classic right side. Death. Death. Just got a tarot? I picked the fool. You got a, an explosion of meat. The pool. <laughs> okay. I picked that. All right, it's just a one shot. Do I need to? I think because each time that you hit one, it like there's one fewer card displayed. Well, this is going to be a pain with Delma. You do have the axe. Star Hero vibe. Yeah, with the final boss roulette. It, it's like the the black area. 
got the dice game. And here it's a roulette of some thing. I used up all my fool cards. Yeah. Without realizing that that's what I was doing. The wheel? Symbol crash death. Alright, there's no more cards. Do I fight now? You now? Fighting death? Yep, now you're actually fighting death. Not sure how I was supposed to avoid that one. Mm hmm. Now to find out if you have to do all of it again. I'm guessing yes. But at least this time you know to avoid hitting the pool until you need health. You don't even have a fully powered up whip. No, you, you don't need to redo it. Yeah, but I don't have a fully powered up whip. Yeah, that's uh, got axes. Oh god, it's just... Hey, I remember this attack! That was in another Castlevania game. Yeah, that was from the first one. Or at least the, the remake of it. Not that. Yeah. Uh, almost got him, one more! Now is he going to transform into a monster, or is he dead for real this time? No, he's just gone. Okay, that was the mid-boss. So <laughs> yeah, it was. That was the sub-boss, was boss refights, and then death. Uh, now it's a Dracula throne room. Here she is. That's... That's her. Then who the hell was it that we fought before? No idea. This one appears to be a boy. Should have guessed that. I. This is. You seem to be at a loss for words. Each of those attacks is in a boss fight in Contra Hardcore. So far. Like this this weird pattern of shots, that pattern of shot, the tail swipe thing. The crawling slowly across the floor at you. Like they they literally just wanted to make Contra again, or possibly vice versa. I'm not sure which of these was first. 
I have to assume that it was Contra first. I can't imagine that they did this on Castlevania on its own. Well, she exploded. Yep, she's balls now. Or is he? No, now she's exploding more. Huh. Okay. Is that... Yeah! The theme of Simon, whom this is not. Oh! Changing it to... Yeah, 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 yeah! Come on! Let's go! The big man himself. The literally big man. Pretty big. He did summon the fire bars from Mario! He does not have very many frames where he's hit. Hopefully we don't have to, like, retry from the beginning of the stage. Nah, no, that's only if you run out of continues. Larger attack box, so you're able to 
to take out his a lot harder but Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh! They didn't seem to be damaging though. Those are just erupting from him as you get as you hit him. Throw your axes. How many axes do you have? And they seem to slow him down. So you might reach him. Yeah! Oh! Nice! Yeah, yeah. Final orb. Yeah. Whew. And my life is restored for the next stage. Did that? That was quick. That was it? I guess so. Like... Okay. It kind of it looked like you skipped it somehow. Yeah, it looks like there should have been more there. But I definitely didn't push any buttons. And now well, they're just okay, showing off their, uh... Um... Armor battler. These are very functional. Yep. It's like, Konami really liked all of, like, the stretchy and swirly things that they could do with the Genesis. Mm -hmm. It's just a gargoyle. Steamer. There's no steam involved. Nope. Yeah, let's find out who the hell this was. Is it just like Princess of Moss? What? Okay. Okay. Would that be Princess of Moth? Like, that would be the kind of mistranslation that could easily happen. Medusa? Yeah, I, I guess... Elizabeth Bath 3 was actually Medusa this whole time? Yeah. She's not a vampire at all. She's a Gorgon. <sighs> well, thanks for playing. Try normal mode. I wonder if the thing cut out because we played it on easy. Well, fuck you. Well, this is it for the 1917, I think it was, this took place. Ah, uh, it sounds right. So, uh, we're actually going to have a very interesting, uh, next game. It comes directly after this. <gasps> In the midst of World War II. <gasps>